if you use a Cavitron, Ultrasonic, Magna Strictive, whatever you call it, I'm assuming you do, sometimes you notice the handle can get hot as you're working on it. And if that's the case, we need to figure out why. There's multiple reasons why your handle could be getting hot as you work on a patient. So the first one is you might not have enough water. So you wanna make sure when you fill up your handpiece, you wanna have it straight up and down and get water all the way up and to see the bubble. If I put it sideways and put my stack in, it's gonna trap water, excuse me, air. It's gonna trap air in the handle. And if that happens, that air bubble gets caught in the stacks. The stacks start to hit each other and it gets really, really hot. So make sure you fill all the way up, see the bubble. Every time you change out your, your insert, you're gonna do the exact same thing. Fill it all the way up, see the bubble, and then put in your stacks. Another thing that you wanna look for is make sure you have the right water setting. So if I put this in here, it's gonna make a mess every time. When I use it, I wanna make sure I have the right amount of water here for the tip and for the power. So if I change out my stacks mid-appointment, I need to adjust my water and my power probably. Another one is you could have a worn out tip. So not without getting too much of the science, when tips wear out, they don't move as well. And if that's the case, they're not moving as well, it can get hot for the patient. So double check your tip, try a different tip, and maybe that will make a difference. Another one is if you're not getting enough water through your cord, it'll get hot in here. So if your cord is cranked during your treatment, it's preventing water to come through, you'll get hot in your hand. So make sure you have some sort of way that you're managing your cord and uh, preventing it from getting cranked somewhere. Don't roll over it with your chair, make sure it's straight nicely. That will make a big difference with the heat as well. And the last one is make sure that you have changed your filter. So a lot of units have a filter in them to prevent any particles or minerals to come through the unit in the, with the water. If you haven't changed your filter in a while, it might be clogged, the water can't come through as well, preventing water in your handle, which will make it hot. So if you're feeling hot in your hand, something's probably up, you might have to do a process of elimination, but you can definitely figure out what's making it less comfortable for you and for the patient. Looking for lots more dental tips or tricks? Make sure you subscribe to Hygiene Edge for all the latest videos, updates, and changes in our profession.